Welcome to Zoe Home Inspired Living. My name is Rina. I'm a chemical engineer by profession, but a grave and debilitating illness put an end to my otherwise successful career. After being very sick and suffering for many years, I'm now well enough to share my life to inspire you to live beautifully no matter what. God bless you. Hello everyone! Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel, Zoe Home Inspired Living. In today's video, we are doing another tea table. We are going to set the table for tea. And we are featuring a very new product for my online store. And that's Royal Crown Derby Mikado. So, this is the Mikado pattern from Royal Crown Derby. And this is quite rare and very pricey. But I got this from Canada. And it arrived, the, the box arrived a few months ago. But it, it was just stored. And now we opened it. It's service for four. Actually, I think this is not a teacup. This is the mitas because it's smaller than a teacup. And one of my subscribers requested that when I present a dinner set or tea set, she requested that I show the back stamp. So this is the back stamp. We found out that they have different back stamps. The plates say it's Royal Crown Derby made in England. The cups are different as well. This one has a Mikado written at the bottom. So this is service for four. Perfect for our family of four. But although I, I plan to keep this for my collection, but I think that I need to choose between this and the Booth's Real Old Willow tea set. That tea set is complete. It has uh, the teapot and the sugar pot and the milk jug. This one, only the plates and the teacups. But this one is five-piece place setting. So this is really a complete uh, setting. There is this luncheon plate, the salad plate, the tea plate or dessert plate, and the teacup and saucer. Now we are going to set the table. This is another toile de jouy fabric, which I'm going to sew into my tablecloth. This is the design is different from the one that I already used in a previous table setting video. So I just measured and cut according to the size of the table with at least 10 inches drop and hemmed all around. I just love these flowers that I ordered from China. They are silk flowers but they look so realistic and the colors are so vibrant and I think that they are also uh, um, suitable for the fall season. This is a pair of vintage, I'm not really sure, of the metal, but this one is marble with a metal base. But I don't know why they have different um, finish. This one is in gold and this one is in silver. 
and because the theme of my next table setting will be blue and white silver and crystal i am going to refinish them this one into silver and this one i'm going to refresh the silver um finish and i'm going to use this this is a silver paint metallic silver paint that i just bought and i'm just going to try it if it's really silver finish i think that they were originally silver but this one has been refinished in gold repainted now i'm just going to clean this up before i will try my silver paint i don't have a video of when i painted them silver both of them but here what i'm doing here is that i am just applying yes wiping on champagne gold it's a very very light gold shade because i don't like the very dark silver finish so i was thinking that if i add or wipe champagne gold all over the silver it will become like a patinaed silver with a tinge of gold so i think that i was able to achieve the finish that i wanted it's like lightening the harsh silver of these candelabras So I was saying that this Royal Crown Derby Mikado pattern is quite rare and really very pricey. Even though I got this at a, at a fair price from Canada and it's not complete but it is in perfect condition, excellent condition. The gold gilding is intact and it is really my very first time to see a mikado pattern in person so this is it i think this is a, a a man and a woman courting i i got it wrong this is a man and this is the woman it's like romeo and juliet yeah the woman uh on the balcony and this man so it's really quite beautiful
Now, if you have a silver tea set that you have been displaying in your cabinet for years and years, and you are wondering when, when would you ever use it for the real tea time? Because maybe you have fine bone china tea sets that you use together as a set. Now this is the time. If you have teacup and saucer sets without the teapot and the sugar bowl and the milk jug, but you have the silver tea set, now is the perfect time to combine them together and use them for your afternoon tea. So this is what we are going to use in this table setting, in this tea table. So this is vintage Sheridan Tonton silver tea set. It also comes with a coffee pot, which I did not include here anymore, the, the coffee pot. So there are five pieces, including the serving tray. So I got this tea set maybe early this year and Although it's gleaming silver like that because we really polish it well, I got them as super tarnished, really black all over, but we polish them good and so they are gleaming and they would look good with our Mikado set.
Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you enjoyed today's video and that I have inspired you to bring out your best bone china and your silver tea set as well and set up an elegant and beautiful tea table. Now, if you are local and you buy from my store also, Zoe Home Inspired Living on Instagram, the Royal Crown Derby Mikado tea set will be available there. I'm going to post it soon. And also this Sheridan Tonton coffee and tea set will also be available there. I think it's already uploaded. And most of the crystal ware that's used here and also the cutlery. Yeah. So you can, you can avail of them if you really want to set up the table like this one. So I will see you in the next video. Thank you. God bless. Bye. So I found out that they have 